listen to this eyes closed process whilst driving or operating machinery. Only listen when you can safely relax completely. Welcome to the mind programming technique that will help you to feel happier in yourself. Focus on success, release your true potential and create more abundance in your life. If you're listening in stereo, these words should be coming from the right hand side and these from the left. During this experience, it's best to be sitting or lying down in a place where you can comfortably ignore the outside world. It's usually helpful to close your eyes. This technique is not the same as sleep. You'll still have awarenesses. You'll be able to hear everything I say and you'll not become unconscious, but there will be changes. It's like daydreaming. All you need to do is relax and let the sounds wash over you. You may find you do not remember it all consciously afterwards, but simply find yourself comfortable as you follow my instructions. Make yourself comfortable now. Close your eyes just as soon as you wish and pay attention to your breathing. If you need to awaken, you'll awaken fully alert. But for now, you can just let go. At the end of this process, you'll awaken refreshed and invigorated with a sense of inner calm and refreshment. So now, notice your breathing, the gentle rise and fall that happens all by itself. And before you relax, take some deeper breaths, push all the way out and gently Breathe in. As you focus your attention on your breathing, now my voice will go with you as you relax. Close your eyes if you haven't already and start counting backwards now from 300. 300. 299. 298, 297, 296, 295, 294, that's two, right, three. counting backwards two, only nine, as fast as two, you begin nine, to deeply relax, two, nine, the little muscles at the side of your eyes and the muscles at the side of your mouth as you become comfortably aware of your chest and legs and comfortably aware of your feet and comfortably aware of your shoulders relaxing your arms, hands and fingers and sensing the weight of your hands and one hand may feel slightly warmer as you go deeper into this wonderfully relaxing daydream where you can hear my voice in many different ways. Here, now, you can feel energies and perceptions, sounds, temperature, sensations and reactions, and the gentle lightness of letting go and peace. You don't even have to think about it. Just let the focus sink deeper and deeper towards your own peaceful inner stillness. And as you do so, that possibility becomes richer and richer and more and more real. 
feel. And you can begin to feel it embrace you and spread through your entire being. You can notice words. Notice noticing words. You can notice noticing your body can relax. And your mind can become very sensitive to my suggestions that help you most. Your breathing carries on all by itself. Your mind carries on thinking all by itself. And you can just watch it wander away. Your experience, your understanding, your awareness can just detach and slow down. My words can be soothing and easy mind. You are learning easily. You love and approve of yourself. You're becoming more responsible. Life supports you. The universe supports you. Your self-image is changing. And you're thinking of yourself in better and more positive ways. I'd like you to stop a moment and imagine a time, let's say several weeks from now, and you've been listening repeatedly Practicing tenaciously, thinking of yourself in a much more positive way, noticing some phenomenal changes. You're getting more done. You're happier. Your relationships are working better. You're starting to see tangible results. What part of your new life are you enjoying the most? Give yourself a sense of that pleasure now. Amplifying and intensifying the feeling of that pleasure. You know by doing what's good for you, by doing what works. Through practice and listening repeatedly, you can achieve the things you want. You know how good it feels when you're doing what's important to you, when you're living your values, and you can more and more every day. Whatever happens, you feel an inner sense of satisfaction from living your values. When you think of a limitation you have, ask yourself, is there anyone with your limitation who has succeeded in spite of it? There are always more ways to look at the world. I'd like to thank that part of your mind that's in charge of your self-image for doing all the good things that it does for you, protecting you, helping you, making you the person that you are. But I'd like it to find new ways now to achieve all the good positive things that it was doing for you, but without unnecessary limitations or negative self-belief. You might not even be aware of what those new ways are going to be now as your unconscious mind decides what they are and check that it's okay for you to have that new self-image and only using ways that there will be no objection to and integrating those ways into your experience and behavior only at a rate and speed that's appropriate. I'd like the imaginative genius part of your unconscious mind to help you come up with solutions to problems. People show you love and respect and you enjoy showing it to others. You find new, exciting, easier ways to work, to have fun and really enjoy life. You will assume that other people are thinking good things about you. Think of someone who loves you, a friend, a relative, or someone else. Someone who you've helped who approves of you. Now, imagine stepping into their body like putting on a new suit of clothes and look at yourself through the eyes of the person who loves you. Appreciate the good qualities you have 
as you see yourself through the eyes of love. Be aware of the thoughts and feelings that they have about you when you've learned about the special qualities that make you lovable. Step back out of that person into yourself again. And so strangely things can turn out well in the world as we attune ourselves to its energy. We learn to be mindful and we learn to listen to our instincts, our inner wisdom, to trust ourselves and to find within ourselves the touchstone of what's right and wrong for us. And from that knowledge comes strength. Think about the ideal, authentic you. See your posture, the way you dress, your manner, and the way others treat you. Now, go over to the ideal you and step into yourself like putting on a new suit of clothes. Feel that amazing difference and get used to it. Imagine yourself in your ideal environment at work and how good does that feel? And at home, how good does that feel? Now, remember one of your happy memories. And now, having chosen that, fully return to it again now. Step into it and see it through your eyes. Hear it through your ears. And feel all those good feelings that go along again. Notice how stepping in like this feels so good. Every day, you'll build up positive and resourceful states of mind and body, confidence, passion, love, whenever happiness and optimism is the resource. By remembering times you when remember you experienced those states state before, mind looking forward to by you. Changing experiences and so many more to imagination. And you, you feel the members strong in your body and around you. Condition your mind is free to expect more of those good feelings in your life every day. I'd like your unconscious mind to go on a search now and remember times when you felt great and totally identify with those times understand how you made yourself feel so great and make those great feelings spontaneously happen more and more stronger and stronger every day you can overcome problems your mind will generate creative ways to overcome obstacles you begin to see yourself as a resourceful, capable person. You enjoy challenges. You realize they make you stronger and wiser, and you get value from your achievements. If you knew deep down inside you that you are here for a worthwhile purpose, that you are here to do something wonderful with your life, you are an exceptional person. How do you feel differently, knowing this to be true? I'd like to talk to you about your critical and negativity for I understand the future when you be critical about anything happens when stars and function ask yourself what you should like to be bad about thank and take the appropriate action for help me focus so far. Things that make you feel good. good. I want you to be cautious mind. This one has really automatic ways. And to achieve your mind the positive benefits, the more it becomes it's your nature. To be truly positive used to give you your mind new ways of thinking and wanting the old ways of becoming the resources you wish to change. You'll notice how good you feel. So much more optimistic and happy. Imagine what kind of person you are. The character qualities you now possess. The confidence. Feelings of security. 
How much do you like yourself even more? Imagine your ideal self. Make that image big, bright and bold. Step into your ideal self. Now your self-esteem is increasing. You can respect yourself. Every step you take is your self-reach. And you are because yourself are the goal of purpose. You feel when you're driving a mystic and excited about occasion. She keeps focused on where you go. Your goals are in harmony with each other. And this makes them easier to achieve. Your goals stretch your abilities. They help you learn and grow. Now you know what you want. Your mind will begin to use its genius to find ways to make it happen. It might consider all the resources you'll need and how to organize and prioritize them. Being aware of obstacles that might have gotten in the way, it's possible to know solutions beforehand. Your mind can constantly change and fine-tune your plans, taking in feedback, just as an aeroplane is continually adjusting course on its way to a destination. Think about some benefits you feel the joy of the results of achieving your goal. Remember how you feel it in every fear. Feel, feel your being the compulsion that is full of the same way you charge you. That it is what's necessary to fulfill your goals. You surround yourself with positive people. People who reinforce your positive self-image. Learn to reinterpret negative things that others might say about you. See their criticisms as a cry for help, as they wish they were as amazing as you. Surround yourself now with a force field of positive energy that confidently allows you to gain something from every situation. Over here now, People saying positive things. Well done. Congratulations. You're inherently good. You deserve, deserve to do well. People really like you. You are successful. You love and approve of yourself. You are clear. Your thoughts are energy. Money flows to resonate and attract you to developing your prosperity consciousness. You, you surround yourself with successful people. people. Well, Make optimism is good. Your Choose a find it easier to enjoy. You remember to ask yourself. You can enjoy and when I do it better next time. Imagine great wealth flowing towards you naturally and effortlessly. It can be notes, checks. You can feel it. Feel good about the fact that you deserve it. Imagine how good it is to really think about and enjoy. Complete financial independence. Imagine the positive differences great wealth gives you and the difference you can make in the world. Picture a really wealthy you. How do you look? What is your confident posture? How do you breathe? Go over now and step into that truly wealthy you, like putting on a new suit of clothes and get used to that good feeling. Feel that wealthy confidence and let that feeling spread through you. You know what it's like to be in the zone, in flow, in a peak state. Now, Remember times when you've been in the zone and imagine times when you will and notice in clear detail feelings of being in flow because when you experience any state your mind and body remembers it and keeps a psychological and 
physiological record of it so that when it's appropriate you can experience it again. Your mind used to wait until you were engaged in certain activities until it triggered the flow state for you. Now, give you even more. It can do it automatically so that you are in flow so often that you produce the results that I'd like your unconscious mind to go on a search through your experience for those specific times and places when you've already experienced the state of flow and collect all of those good feelings and perceptions and knowledge and bring them forward in time through the now into the future whenever it's frequently appropriate for you to experience it you can ever more effortlessly and easily go with the flow and I don't know if you can really imagine just yet how much increased joy and pleasure you're going to be living with now when you remember about all the experiences and learnings of flow that you have, how much more experience is there for you to learn and benefit from the experience of others. As you practice, you become skilled. What you place your attention on, you get more of. As you place your attention more and more upon entering and remaining in a state of flow, you will experience this desirable state more and more, like a river flowing strongly and easily downstream. Your flow state goes with whatever you're interested in. Every day, when you practice the flow state, you strengthen and reinforce the neural pathways of flow in your brain. You can live each day. Each breath is a work of art, unfolding and enjoying the unique beauty of each moment. As it unfolds, you enjoy just being in this moment. You will find that you are happier and more fulfilled from this day forth. You automatically find more joy and beauty in each moment. Imagine how you would look if you were totally happy and fulfilled. Now, make a clear, bright picture in your mind and then Go over and step into that happier you. Feel how good the feelings feel, the difference in thoughts, and let that learning encode into your neurology and physiology. Now, you are at one with all things. You go into flow states easily and naturally. You absorb yourself with activity that's appropriate, positive, and life-enhancing. You choose to enter the flow state by enjoying more of what you do every day, even the smallest daily activity can be a flowful occasion. You experience more and more times and situations where flow becomes useful and appropriate. Your unconscious now can flow you at any time of the day or night. While dreaming, you practice and incorporate your learning and experience to help your life flow more smoothly. With each breath, you're reminded of your connection flow. Imagine yourself in a time now 
where everything is all right. Everything is exactly as it should be. Look around, see what you see, hear what you hear, and feel how good it feels to be in this good time. Really notice every tiny detail of this experience, and what lets you know that everything is okay. The more good things you notice, the more you're letting good feelings encode deeply into your neurology, really enjoying exploring your ideal world. Now, go through your ideal day, enjoying how well it starts, the people you meet, the ways they respond to you, places you go, things you do. Take the time to do it now. Delight at the ingenuity of your imaginative mind. See what you see in richer detail. Hear what you hear. And feel how good you feel. Now. There is a creature called Caterpillar. There is only on my way throughout the world. Then one day, sometimes think to myself to go and Once there is nothing. And I don't know how much there is in life life. So many changes are possible, and it's important to relax. And you can ask your unconscious mind to let you know very clearly when you can safely and usefully relax, so that you notice a sweet, soft feeling in your muscles and find your own peace. Whenever you relax, you can let yourself relax as much as you need to. And when you need to awaken, you can awaken with a bright, delightful alertness. And as you become aware of the wish to be active, you'll feel yourself enjoying that. But before you awaken, I'd like you to reinforce every positive thought that you've ever had about yourself. Because we all know we can daydream, we can all sleep, and we can all wake up, although we don't consciously know how we do that. And you can awake now, as I count backwards, refreshed and alert. Wake up now, calm and confident. Ten. Nine. Eight, gradually awakening. Seven, six, five, four, and maybe you'll want a nice stretch and a yawn as you awaken. Three, two, one.